So this is how you can edit a document in your MacBook, right? So at first we need to locate where the document is saved, right? So we need to open up the finder. You can find it on the um, like uh, tab bar at the bottom of the dock. And when you open it up, a bunch of, of your folders are gonna appear on the screen. So you can now just locate it manually in your documents or downloads, or you can also use the search bar to find the name of that specific file or even search for the extension of the file like PDF or doc or whatever. But if you just find it right, you can go ahead and uh, just locate that document, whatever it might be. And then what you can do is to open it up or open it with a different app. So you can right click on it and choose open with. And it just gets interesting because this is going to show you all of the options which you have available. So if it's a Word document, you can open it up with the Pages app, which is built in on the MacBook, and then you can edit that file, right? If it's, a, if it's an image, what you can open it with is the Photoshop, if you have it, or Adobe Acrobat, a PDF editor, right? So there are different things, as I said, if you lack some sort of app which you would be able to customize or edit it with then you need to get one from the internet for instance if you need to edit pdf documents you need to download some sort of pdf editor using which you're going to be able to open up the document and perform some changes so this is how essentially you can do this the way to edit documents is essentially endless based on your preferences and the software that you are using but you need to know which file type you want to edit and if whether or not you have the software required or capable of doing such things so that's everything i wanted to explain to you let me know below in the comments if you managed to do it or if you have now successfully uh, finished editing your documents. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe to this channel so you never miss another tutorial like this one in the future. And I'll see you later on in the next video.